Uh, I'm gonna allow the person to my left. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Do it again, do it again, do it again. <laughs> I'm like, so you're burping, you're breaking lines. Anything else you wanna do? The world's gonna end. Come on, smash the camera. Why don't you beat up Neil? Lawrence, get him. Hello, everyone. I support Arsenal. This is Arsenal. I love them. He's not Jamaican. I'm poet. This is David Vianic. And welcome to comments below. Will you leave your comments below? But before you do that, can you please subscribe? Please subscribe. Is it up here? Somewhere. So. You subscribe, all right? You leave your comments below. We choose some comments. We talk about them. Things we like, things we don't like. And then we have that epic moment in the show that can <clears> only be described as... Comment of the week! Why? Where's your iPad? Well, the production team decided not to give me one this week. I don't know why. I believe it's because they have a lack of monies. And they're taking their monies away to buy presents for people. I think that's out of order. So, so I'll, I'll be using my phone this week. But before all of that happens, we go straight on to some quickfire comments such as... Jeremy Effer said, what do you call a cat with no legs? A cat! Straight to the point, On to the it? next one. Bobby Borisov says, the unemployment in Bulgaria is higher than Javidio's hairline. That, nah, I think. That must be flipping high. Next comment. This is from Rai Hanatelli. <laughs> Poet, how did you miss that open goal against Bradford City in the Capital One Cup? Well, basically, How? my very high yeah, hairline yeah. got in the way of the whole situation. I was quite uh, confused. Remember, when you've got a forehead, I've got a six head. So it's just a bit too much for me, you know what I mean? Last one, we've got Liam Hollister here saying, all right, I'm going to go through them very Good quickly. Points. You should answer them. Yaya Rocolo. Yaya. Fabio or Raphael. Fabio. Hanson or Shearer. Shearer. Terry or Bridge. Bridge. <laughs> McDonald's or KFC. KFC. Xbox or PS3. Xbox. Head or... No, you didn't say anything about that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, on to the first comment. It's usually like the biggest, ma massive um, story of the week that's happened in the weekend football events. Uh, it's Julio Mantra, and I've seen Julio a couple of times. Keep me leaving in comments, Julio, we like you. What do you think about Fellaini's punishment for headbutting Shawcross? Was the ban less because headbutts on Stoke players don't count? <laughs> Flipping out. Well, you know, <laughs> tell a lie, I have heard yeah. before they come on to training, Stoke players have to headbutt the post first. Ah. A few times. I don't think the punishment is harsh enough. Mm. Uh, it's an off the ball incident. It's not, for example, it's definitely not accidental. Why did he do it? It wasn't really a typical headbutt because of, of his afro. Afro got in the way. It I think was it was soft, didn't it? It was soft. It was, was like getting a cotton bun and sticking it in yeah. your face or something, isn't it? <laughs> it doesn't it really was, hurt. And he kind of did it really weirdly. Like he went really close and he was like. It's quite intimate. Isn't so it, it wasn't like maybe a bang. Like to Shawcross. Maybe it was like a way of saying. Know, I don't know. Maybe he thought it was a microphone. Maybe he was trying to kiss him. Maybe he was trying to kiss him. Like, oh, hey, you're cute. And then, pretty much ban, I guess. Kind pretty of much ban. Pretty fair, of. seeing as the afro. If he didn't have the afro, yeah. six match ban. If it was Stone Cold Steve Austin or someone like that, yeah. I think that's like a nine match ban, probably. Carragher, nine match ban, definitely. Suarez, lifetime ban. <laughs> <laughs> Don't come back on the pitch. Next comment. <laughs> this is from IIX Hilson XII. He was said, <laughs> Brendan Rogers says Liverpool finish in the top two, loses to Aston Villa. What is the problem? Deluded. Right now? What a deluded man. <laughs> when I read, someone sent me an article and it said, Brendan Rogers hopes for a top two finish. Top two? We're eighth, tenth. We were like four points off top of the fourth spot. And now we've lost to Villa at home. And even a West Ham match was really lucky. And I think, I don't know, I, I personally, from the day when I heard he was coming into Liverpool, yeah. I wasn't happy. I didn't think it was high profile enough. Maybe I'm just sexually frustrated and I'm taking my anger out on Liverpool. You know, I guess, you know, we'll talk about Liverpool come the rest of the season. But, you know, hope is the last thing that dies. And it's I'm going to keep on hoping. Moving on. SP Mojo, talk about 21st of December. Now you're probably thinking, why are we talking about the 21st of December? What is so special about this particular day in the month of December? We're all apparently gonna die. Are we? Let's just reverse it again. We're all apparently gonna die. <laughs> now. We're all apparently gonna die. <laughs> Well, Doomsday probably beckons. Oh, <laughs> They'll pay for that. <laughs> so basically, your wages are cut. I think that I shows mean, if we're that gonna, something's happening. If I was Freud, a famous psychologist, okay, what would you I say? would say this represents me having sex with a parent and everybody dying or something like that. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know, maybe it represents something. Maybe maybe we are gonna die. Maybe you know what, you're gonna find out because if our next episode doesn't come, doesn't out. come out and you don't see it and we're not on, on your screen, then we're all dead. We're all dead. You know what? Next time we should do it topless. And then we'll see. If we are here, we shall do it topless. topless. 
Next comment, next comment. Uh, I'm gonna allow the person to my left. Sorry, 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 do it again, do it again, do it again. Oh my, so you're oh, burping, you're breaking lines. Anything else you wanna do? The world's gonna push. end, like. No, we'll smash the camera. Oh, why don't you beat up Neil? Lawrence, get him. Uh, all right. <sighs> okay, um, this is from O Shandy. Float like a butterfly. Fly no, like you're, now you're reading the wrong comment. <laughs> you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> I'm firing him. Forget it. Saeed Mohammed. Poet, what do you think RVP singing Glory, Glory, Man United? I thought that was a coward thing to do, and I'm a big Arsenal fan. Um, I don't, I think he's pretty brave because he's done it and he's thinking to himself, I don't care what these Arsenal fans think. He even had the audacity to apologise in a recent interview but saying he's never been happier in his whole life. Well, I think you need to really get rid of your missus then because she's also meant to be bringing happiness to your life. We don't like her because she didn't listen to me when I tweeted her as well. I said to her, tell Van Persie to stay and she didn't even respond. <gasps> It's awful, isn't it? Shock horror. Van Persie, I don't like you, but I do wish you the best success in life because you gave us, you gave us one glory. You don't really do you? No, not at all. No, no, he was there for eight seasons and done one good year. Let's move on to the next one. All right, we are at that beautiful moment in the show, and I would say a beautiful moment in life. It is only known as comment of the week. And this week, the comment of the week is from O'Shandy, who has said, float like a butterfly, fly like a bee. Since I fucked your mother, it stings when I pee. It's quite creative, that. If you've ever had an STD before, you will know it really hurts. I've had one. I've had several. I went to the place, they gave me pills. I'm better now. At the time, I contemplated taking my life. It was extremely Whoa. harsh. I stood over the toilet, and throughout the whole process, whatever was coming out of my willy really hurt. Like it fire, stung. was it? Like it was fire? like fire. It was the equivalent of putting an iron on your penis. Now, who would do that? Silly people. Safe, I'm not silly, yeah. but I was silly enough to catch it in the first place. Please strap up. We promote safe sex here. Everyone use condoms. If you don't use condoms, you'll end up like me and this person in the poem. We're at the end of the show. I'm upset. How about you? I'm very upset, you know. I broke a lamp. Yeah. Do Doomsday apparently is looming upon us. And also, if we are here next week, we're going to have to do it topless. If the 21st doesn't come by and wipe out humanity as we know it. And we're also, we're also going to be doing a challenge next week. Oh my god, what is I'm it? I'm not sure what it is, I don't know. Could be headbutting each other, it could be a crossbar challenge, it could be a penalty shootout, it could be, I don't know, we'll see what they give us. But, you know, you've got a very exciting episode to look forward to next week. So definitely subscribe and like and comment and that's comment, it comment, really. Comment, and comment, I think, comment, 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 I think, comment, 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 comment. and think now we have to leave. Let's do it this way. Let's walk up and just walk off because we've never done that before. Because it really feels like you're leaving that way, innit? Right, so we'll leave our one eye. Pad. I'll take my phone with me. Take your phone with you. Take care, everyone. Take care, everyone. See Bye. You later. Bye. End of the world. So watch it through there properly. Yeah. There we go. Oh, looks like you got a strike. No. Look at it again. Oh, what a crafty edit point, and the ball suddenly going slower. You guys talk about being naked a lot. Yeah. Mm. That's cool. What are we gonna do later? <laughs> <laughs>